Anfield, one of the most storied venues anywhere in the football world. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And everyone here on tenterhooks, you'd have to say, with good reason, it is Liverpool versus Kerala Blasters. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And this is how Liverpool will line up. Alisson begins in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. Thiago starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, although we have it down as a 4 5 1, it's actually more likely to be a 4 2 3 1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10, and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. And number 11, the Egyptian king, Mohamed Salah. Thank you for attending Anfield. Enjoy the game. The fans are always part of the story here at Anfield, and they get underway. Darwin Nunez. And a good tackle. Diamantakos. Chances on. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Encouraging move from Liverpool. Alexander Arnold. Well, he really read that brilliantly. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Adrian Luna. And a significant block following that cross. Real chance. And it's one of the finest goals you're ever likely to see. Simply stunning. Well, just look at this. Magnificent agility, perfect timing and great connection. What a goal that is. Well, the action continues. Is there to be a response from Liverpool now? There needs to be. Nunez. Thiago. Well, no stopping him. Options in the centre. And the textbook interception. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Gakpo. Fabinho now. Overcooked that one.
Marko Leszczewicz. And teammates around him. Robertson. This could be the equaliser. But oh, what an important save. How about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. And he might be through here. And players waiting in the centre. Terrific block. Well, there you have it. Liverpool have controlled most of the possession, but they've shown a real lack of creativity today. They need to be far more inventive in the final third if they're to turn things around here. Well, let's see if they can win the ball back and do something with it. Electing to cross into the centre. He's gone and found the net! Brilliant piece of finishing! Magnificent goal! Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area, but look at the defenders. They lose their concentration, become sloppy with their marking, and as a result, they find the ball in the back of their net. Just not good enough. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. This might have potential. Crossed accurately towards the far post. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. This might be ideal for the counter. He's in here. And missed time to run, sadly. That's offside. <laughs> and that brings to an end the first half here at Anfield. Well, not really too many opportunities for Mo Salah to show us class in this game, Stuart. Well, I've been disappointed with his game so far. As those touches show us, he just hasn't been getting into the right sort of areas. That's got to be improved if they're to get back into this one. So, back underway here, into the second half. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Oh, that's a fine save. They take it short. Must be! And the keeper more than equal to it. So a personnel change then. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, thumped clear. Mo Salah. And back with Robertson. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Thiago! Oh, good save. How about the short corner? Alexander Arnold. Must be. And a fine stop. Substitution for Liverpool. Coming off the 
they decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Van Dijk. Here's Thiago. A really top-notch piece of defending. And into the last 30 minutes now. Real chance. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Who can they pick out? Struggling to get it away. Oh, body in the way, crucially. Gakpo. This is Salah. Can they hit on the break? Defenders need to cover. Salah! Oh, Mark. Oh, good save. Excellent header. And cleared away over the byline and a corner kick to come. Here it is now, the substitution. Short corner it is. And Dyke. Oh, blocked it. Under real pressure defensively. Will they pay the price? And how well the keeper did. Well, that's just exceptional. He reacted so quickly there. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Now sending it in. Well, not the best clearance. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Luna. Well, you can really sense the frustration. Now, hold on, Stuart. They're in here. And a goal! Wonderful stuff as they accelerate away from the opposition. Well, let's take another look. And you have to say, the defending is so poor. That's far too easy. The keeper had no chance there. Three goals without reply. Well, not giving the opposition a look in. That's strong play. Miranda with it. Not showing good defensive judgment. Happy to take on the shot. And the keeper got there. Going short. Corner again. <laughs> Delivering it. And the danger's still on. Well, nothing comes of it. 
and be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Luna. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. Gakpo. The sound of the referee's whistle and the headline here, Liverpool lose. Your assessment of the performance? Well, Derek, the fans are right to expect more. The tempo of their passing was too slow. They were second to the ball too many times and were beaten by the better side today. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.